All right, here's my test setup. Got a camera. Got another camera over here. Got some weight down here. I have a strain wave with about, let's say, uh, 330 millimeters to my lifting point. Got a uh, motor to um, actuate the actuator. And I've got a scale, which just turned off, to weigh my load. About 851 grams. Uh, that's weird. Okay, we've got 968 grams. So, I'm going to go ahead and run the test now. Test one, no problem. Alright, so that's the ground. So that is pretty easy. The failure mode is going to be pretty obvious because um, I already broke one without even putting any load on it. This just is fatigue. But the, uh, the interface between these layers is the weak point. And there might be two, uh, two lines of 6mm filament here. If that, I'm not even, the diameter of the filament may be extruded smaller. But that's where this thing is going to fail. We'll go ahead and add whatever this is going to be. It's going to be nice and off balance, but it's more fun for the test. All right, so we've doubled the weight, so that's 2,000 grams. Test number two. No. Uh oh. We got a fail. We got a ratcheting. All right, so that's too much. That's about 14. Grams. This is test number three. You know what? That seems to be working okay. Sixteen hundred grams. Test number four. Nah. Seventeen, seventeen hundred grams ish. That seems to be working good. Some big jump. It's had, it has some big jump. So we're back up to back up to 2,100 grams. I have the um, I have the uh, flex wave generator pushed back more. Let's see if this uh, will help. So that's actually working. All right, well, um, I guess I gotta get another one, two, three block. All right, test number, I lost count. 2,500 grams.
there. actually have this fully seated against the inner bearing which maybe even is more impressive so yeah I think this is a win Let's, it's not warm either promising 